welcome to duo desk today i'll be showing you guys what books i referred for my ninth grade so um i did refer a lot of book so let us just start by the maths book for first let me show you guys the rt sharma mcq book so this book has a lot of mcqs honestly and i did practice a lot from it and i do recommend you guy guys to buy this one it is very very helpful especially for your exams since you know um, schools make um, ninth grade exams very hard now let's come to the main rd sharma mathematics book this book is very very amazing especially for PYQs. You guys should do the PYQs from this one, and yeah, this is very very good, and it is also a very thick one. That is why kids get scared a lot. But honestly, this is quite easy. Now let us come to the next book, which is the S Chand book. I didn't use this book a lot, but it was very tough level one. so if you are very very good for uh, good in maths you should uh, purchase this but i honestly refer you not to i practice triangles and uh, like geometry par part from these books but honestly it has like ncert exemplar and ncert questions like fully solved so you if you want you could use this also it was written by dr rama verma um so yeah it is quite helpful only if you are like very 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 pro in maths next one is the science one um so these are ashan books uh, i bought three of them um, biology chemistry and physics so yeah these are pretty good also it costed me around 1500 but um the biology one was given by uh, a senior of mine so let's let me start showing that to you guys so um, the biology one has a lot of deleted portions so this one was um, i guess the deleted one improvement in food resources so let us not show you guys this one i'll show you another chapter of this so um as you can see it is so well explained like you could just read it and understand it you don't even need to like watch any one shot videos i would recommend you like 100% purchase this and it also has so many questions with answers so many it also has ncert in text questions ncert questions and a lot of extra questions honestly if you just memorize these you are a very good to go for your exam now let us come to the physics one um the physics one i would say the same thing again so this is very well explained it also has the ncert in text questions and ncert questions extra questions so it has first it would give you the explanation and then it will give you the questions and also do solve a lot of solved examples from this book also you can just read it and only if you have doubt you could watch any youtube video but honestly this is perfect for um people who are weak in physics and it also has a answer to specific questions uh, as you can guys can see so let us move move to the next one which is the chemistry part the chemistry part is also the same very well explained and a lot of questions i love this book honestly chemistry is my weak one so next next one is the one shot book of educart written by prashant bhaiya i know i purchased a lot of uh, science books but honestly i didn't need much and um, also i got this from a senior he bought it and he didn't want to use it so he just kept it like that and gave it to me this has so much uh, or uh, like questions mcq long case based questions and so many diagram questions very short uh, answer questions so it also has solutions at the end of the chapter it doesn't have like questions and answers question and answers and it was very good i also did some mcqs like very few mcqs from this book um but i won't say it is very very necessary but it's your choice if you want to buy it or not it costed me around like 330 but i 
but like obviously i didn't buy it myself it was given by a senior now let's come to the next one like the science question bank of oswal these are the oswal question bank i won't say the notes are very good of uh, from this book but the questions are very very good you should practice it i didn't practice a lot from this book but i wish i did because a lot of um, questions came from this book and it has every kind of um, questions every literally every kind of questions very short answer vaqs and yeah it is very helpful it also has like the self assessment paper so you could test yourself and yeah that is pretty much it now let's move on to the social science one the social science one also i would say the same thing it doesn't really have much um pretty notes like the notes are not good but it does have some mnemonics and good mind maps so it is good for revision but i won't say you should learn theory from it but it has good questions i would say that for every single oswald book like look at the questions these are pyq so well answered honestly you should go for it so let's move on to the next one um so the next one is the hindi uh, book so yeah first i'll show you how how much i have buyed so the hindi one is also um, very good like very good this the hindi one was my favorite honestly from oswal books because um, the grammar was so well explained the exercise portion was very good um my teacher also referred us uh, this book also look at the summary guys you could just read it and not read the whole chapter from the ncrt you could you would still understand the chapter and the questions are also very very amazing so please buy this for hindi if hindi is your not your first language and it is the second one then you should go for it by the way guys i accidentally uh, ordered two hindi books and then i forgot to write, return it so yeah that that costed me a lot but whatever um i mean tenth grade so it doesn't matter anymore let's move on to the english one the english one had grammar portion very very well but um the poem and literature i won't say it was very good because the questions were good but the summary was so short honestly i didn't also do summary from this book i did it from online like the internet and i honestly read the ncrt book i only did some questions from it the grammar portion from it it was pretty good but i won't recommend if you want to do summaries from this book also it was pretty good it costed me around 400 now uh, so these are all i know it seems a lot but i accidentally bought two hindi books so yeah let's remove that and also i bought a lot for science because i'm very weak in science but honestly two of them were given by my uh, senior so yeah this was given by my senior so it's fine i guess um, but i sh- don't recommend you guys to buy this much honestly so yeah that's it uh, i'll show you what total books i owned so this is the ashan one it costed 500 rupees but i got it for free obviously and this one's the physics one it costed me around 640 obviously when i bought it it was pretty cheap i guess it was all uh, chemistry one was also um 650 the ashan mathematics one was around 500 i guess um and the uh, rd sharma i don't remember what it costed but uh, okay so it costed me around like probably 600 i guess in total i don't know i don't really remember so okay that's it now this is the clip of when i was studying the nationalism in europe i want to tell you guys something don't buy this much books you don't need it okay only buy the required ones thank you